Some of the folks just aren't. That would be your gunsmith. Daisy Fitzroy. She's either a great hero or the worst of scoundrels, depending on who's doing the town. She's good for an airship. I don't care if she's the Queen of Holland. Israelites have not made their bricks. Welcome to Fink Industries Recruitment. We are not looking for any help. You hear that? No help. How are we going to get into Finkton? Illegally. Let's look for another way in. Fake Industries is not recruiting at this time. Please come again. Can you unlock this? Got it. Over there, a service elevator. It should take us down to Finkton. And get ourselves killed in the bargain. We hold these troops to be Catch, Booker! Great! My aim is true. Slate's locker. He must have worked here. Uh, this is my mother's diary. Why would Slate have it? My husband claims the child was created from whole cloth by divine will. I am a believer, but I am not a fool. His bastard shall not be raised under this roof. My mother. She had me locked in that tower. Elizabeth. I just want to get out of this city. Please.
Greetings. My name is Jeremiah Fick, and I want to share with you my personal creed. What is the most admirable creature on God's green earth? Why, it's the bee. Have you ever seen a bee on vacation? Have you ever seen a bee take a sick day? Well, my friends, the answer is no. So I say, be the bee. Be the bee. Hello? Mr. DeWitt? Uh, yes? Hold for Mr. Fink, please. What's going on? DeWitt, Fink here. Listen, my boy, we've had our eye on you, and I can tell you right now that you are our top candidate. Top! <laughs> now, uh, my associate, Mr. Flambeau, will help you with anything you need. <laughs> what the hell was that? I have no idea. He seems oddly pleased to make your acquaintance. Got an ego. Find a variety More money. of supplies here. Cash. We see you for a visit. Perfect timing. What does Mr. Fink want with this? Excuse me, miss, but Mr. Fink's interest is strictly in the gentleman. But why? So sorry, young miss, but any questions regarding the gentleman's application should be taken up with Mr. Fink directly. Does this strike you as good news? Doesn't strike me as good news. Do you know what Daisy Fitzroy and her anarchist cronies want for you? <laughs> uh, strike, they say. What do you think? Head to the gunsmith or scavenge supplies by the clock shop? Fifteen minutes. Fifteen minutes now, bid fourteen. We give me fourteen. Ten. Ten minutes, bid now ten. We give me nine. Nine. Nine minutes, bid now nine. Here it is, Booker. Chen Lin, gunsmith. I've read about this. That's got my Buddha. Founder of Buddhism, he spent 49 days in the Bodhi tree until he achieved enlightenment. Hello, hello, Mr. Lin, Chen Lin, is anybody here? What happened here? Someone worked this place over. Local constabulary, no doubt. <laughs> Do you hear that? There's someone downstairs. Excuse me. Now I'm sorry to bother you. I... We're looking for Mr. Lin. Mr. Chen Lin. Booker. Mr. Lin, not here. He gone. Gone? They take flying squad. I pray, Gautama Buddha. Pray, give husband back. Give back to Mei Lin. Where did they take him? Club. Everyone take to good time club. Where is this club? 
Ma'am, please, where, where is this club? Booker will find it. <gasps> Just leave her be. Why not Fox Pooley help Chen Lin? Why not Daisy Fitzroy help Chen Lin? Cops. <laughs> Cops. The kind who probably got their boot on Lin's throat asking him how well he knows Daisy Fitzroy. Isn't she the one we're working for? As a matter of fact, it is. Let's figure out where this good time club is. Shen Lin and get the hell out of here. Now, now, all I ask is that you finish what you started to it. Wouldn't want to disappoint the other applicants. Our first candidate is a veteran of Peking. Now, what's that they say about old soldiers? <laughs> Frankly, my money's on you. He's something of an old hand at handling explosives. Only man I know who hasn't <laughs> lost a limb working with them. <laughs> Yet. Oh, 
yourselves. No mercy for us! For us all. Take this! Here, ammo! interested in your job, Fink. Now, now, I know all about your little job for Fitzroy. But do you really want to take her offer over mine? Do you know how many people would kill to be head of Fink Security? <laughs> You're a tough nut to crack, Mr. DeWitt. A tough nut. <laughs> but uh, I promise you this. I will get what I want. There's a door over here. I think that's the way down. Hmm. You're a modern woman. It's 1912. It's gonna be 2012 before I'm interested in one like you. It's him! Uh. 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 
Cell number nine. Hmm. Need some help with this. Looks simple enough. I used to work for folks like Fink. Really? And I was with the Pinkertons. They call us in when the workers got restless. To do what? Demonstrate the folly of men striking, throwing down tools. You hurt people. I'll tell you this. Sometimes there's precious need for folks like Fitzroy. Why? Because of folks like me. Done. No point hiding. Over. down here. Needs picking. Really? That little old lock. What could people have done to deserve to be locked up in a place like this? Fink don't need much of a reason. No. No, he doesn't. You wanna take a look at this? Come on. Give me this is it, isn't it? Yep. Number nine. It's done. Do it? You're a liar. Here's some cash. After my own interests, can you? Now I know Fitzroy has come calling, but I think you'll find your business with her has come to an end. <laughs> lions walk with lions, do it, not hyenas. Now we need to find someone else to make those guns. No. Dead is dead, Elizabeth. Dead is dead. What? Where the hell did... I see heads. And I see tails. It's all a matter of perspective. Why are you following us? Who sent you? Comstock? What do you want? What do you see here from this angle? Dead. Listen. And that angle? Alive. Walker. Chen Lin. The body's gone. It was never here. It's another Columbia. A different Columbia. The same coin. A different perspective. Heads. Tails. Dead. Alive. We have to go through to this other Columbia, but how? It's like riding a bicycle. One never really forgets. One just needs the courage to climb aboard. If we go into this tail, be able to bring us back. Are you sure you're ready? Okay, open it. Look, there's no blood. And no body. It's another world, Booker. Columbia. Something tells me one dead gunsmith ain't the only thing that's changed.
what you do. Daisy Fitzroy. Come on, you piece of bullshit. Tell me about Daisy. Cut him loose. What? Scarfield says cut him loose. I don't understand how Chen Lin is alive now. We're in a world where he was never murdered. Somewhere we we'll find out why. I don't suspect you can change something like that and have everything else remain the same.